is time for Drew's News, your daily bowl of fresh good news pasta with that perfect al dente chew. <laughs> and with me at the desk is my main news noodle, Ross Matthews. That's right. Hi, everybody. Hi. Oh, I know you're excited about this week. I know, it's pasta week and we're throwing a five day all out pasta party to yeah. celebrate one of the best food Oh my God, and my favorite. And to kick it off, I hear we have a pasta proclamation from the pasta queen herself, Chef Nadia Caterina Mundo. Hi, you and Ross, it's me, matriarch of the macaroni family. I am so thrilled you're celebrating my favorite food, pasta. I want you to enjoy all the pastas in the pasta kingdom. So today I'm officially anointing you pasta queen and pasta king of pasta week. You may now put on your crowns. Yeah. First of all, thank you, Nadia. Now, the pasta queen is a very, very beloved woman on TikTok, and she was kind enough to do our show in the very beginning. We made pasta al limone, which is one of my very favorite pastas in the world, Rossi. I see that you have a, I'm not kidding, it's hard to talk because my tongue and my yeah. mouth just want to be here. <laughs> you have a different pasta in front of you. What Pray tell, are you eating? I love, she asked me a question, it's only so she can eat her pasta. You guys saw that, right? <laughs> like, she really doesn't care. I, do I, care. I know you care, but like, you're just focused on that. But, so yours is a pasta a, a la limone, right? Oh. So my favorite pasta is an untraditional one. It's gonna surprise some of you. This is cold pasta salad with like the vegetables in it and like the mayo base, you know what I'm talking about? I love pasta salad, Rashi. Mm, and it's sort of sweet because of the relish. And mm, I love- tang. Tang, girl. This is tangful. That's exactly what this is. Well, first up in our in our news today and stories is some noodle news for oh. Pasta Week. It's about Robert Pattinson. Oh, you love Robert Pattinson. Who doesn't? Hello, I, I don't know. Is there someone here who doesn't like Robert Pattinson? Speak now. Show yourself. <laughs> Well, either I scared you or it is true. He is beloved by all. And the cut reports that the newest Batman has his very own pasta dream. He wants to create the first pasta you can hold in your hand. And he calls it Pasta Cucino. He already has run experiments. He sticks together a lump of penne with layers of sugar and cheese and coats it with cornflakes and then microwaves it. And he says it should be served on a bun like a hamburger. It hasn't come together yet, but Robert is serious. He even met with frozen food companies against the advice of his management. Oh dear, oh dear. I mean, that's against nature, don't you think? Well, All he, that together? He coats it with the cheese and then he microwaves it. And one of the things that I found out um, from digging into the details was that he says all of life's pleasure foods uh, burgers, sandwiches, tacos are all hand friendly, uh -huh. but pasta is not, and it's time for it to be. Okay. Well, uh, you know. <laughs> Let me tell you, let me tell you how cruel nature is that Robert Pattinson can look like Robert Pattinson and eat that, and I would walk by, smell it, and look like this. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Unacceptable, Mother Nature. Uh, also, <laughs> do you know what cocina, cocina means? Cushion. Cushion, which is exactly what you get if you eat what Robert Pattinson makes you. <laughs> <laughs> but you, I, you can make me one, Robert Pattinson, I'll try it. Anything that our Pats does works for me. Works for me, too.